that looks great. Good. So let's start off. We're going to go T-spine rotations. You're going to go into a lunge. Let me bring it back a little bit more. Nice. We're going into a lunge. Lunge backwards. Leg that goes back. Bring the arm down. Open up towards that knee. Okay. We're going five on each side. In there. Hit it. Five on each. Awesome. Once we hit those five rotations, okay, we're gonna go into the inchworm. The feet are together. I'm walking myself out. You have two options. You can hit a push-up, or you can do your rotations in here. Either or. And then come right back to your toes. All right? Same thing. Five. Five inchworms, up to you. Walk it out. You can do a push-up or you can op simply open things up on each side. Awesome. Great, once we hit those five, okay? We're stepping into that side lunge. I'm coming out, okay? For this hand comes to the inside of the foot, touch. And then we alternate sides. So feet are together, touch, take a step out, touch. For this arm, take a touch to the inside of that leg, okay? Same thing, five and five on each side, five and five on each. Then toe, touch, for this arm. Awesome. Once we hit the five and five, we're going to go into what we call around the worlds. So get a wide stance in here, okay? And just break at the hip. So I'm leaning in and I'm trying to make the biggest circle that I can with my hips of my body. Once I be come back to center, I open up to the opposite way. So I'm doing same thing, five. So 10 total, all the way through, and all the way back is one. As big as you can. Steering your hips from your lower back. Full rotation all the way. One. And all the way back. Two. Five and five. Once you hit that, almost done. Drop into that lunge, going backwards. I'm just gonna rotate towards the front knee. Okay, then we switch. Five and five. 10 total lunges with a rotation. Hit that lunge, rotate towards the front knee. So here's what we're gonna do now. That's part one of the warm up, just slowly building up. Now we're gonna get our heart rate to our max. So now we should be putting in about not, at least 90% effort into it. So every minute, every minute on the minute. So you have one minute, okay? Your goal is to do 20 squats, three burpees, minute one. Minute two, once we hit the second minute mark, okay? You're doing 18 squats. So we're, take, so we're taking away two squats. Okay, or adding, we're adding, sorry, uh, we're doing push-ups, not burpees. We're adding a push-up, so four push-ups. Minute number three would be 16 squats, okay, five push-ups. Makes sense? So we're going to take away two squats, but we're going to add a push-up. Five minutes, five rounds. Okay, our goal is to do the five minutes without stopping. Okay, I'll guide you guys through it. So minute number one, okay, we're going to start in three seconds. Goal is 20 squats, three push-ups. Here we go, three. Two, one, hit it. Game on. So the quicker you get this done, the longer your break is gonna be. This is that point now where we're trying to build up our heart rate, okay?
and our body temperature to rise. So we should be going about 90% effort as many as we are as fast as we can get it from hitting those squats. Okay, once I'm done, hit your three push-ups. You gotta get on your on your knees, get on your knees, but do your best to do them on your toes. Nice. We are 25 seconds in. The second we hit minute number two, we're doing 18 squats, four push-ups. Stay strong. 40 seconds in, 20 seconds. Start building up, get ready. Here we go, 18 squats, four push-ups. We go, in, five, four, three, two, hit it. Round two, round two, 18 squats, four push-ups. Check it out. Nice job. Now, if you want the extra challenge, you can do jump squats. If you want the extra challenge on the push-ups, you can do uh, pressing, explosive push-ups, up to you. We have 30 seconds left. 30 seconds left. Nice. Nice and easy. Stretch out what you need to stretch out. We got 20 seconds left before we hit round number three. Stay strong. 16 squats, five push-ups. Round three. We start in five, four, three, two, one. Round three, hit it. 16 squats, five push-ups. Do it up. Stay moving, stay moving, yep. Nice, Kier. Six push-ups. Sorry, five push-ups. Um, we can figure out more. Maybe, yeah, <laughs> thank you. Oh, perfect. Nice, last 15. 14 squats, six push-ups. Okay, so we're moving up on that ladder. Here we go, five, four, three, two, hit it. On to the next. Nice, eating those, yep. Nice. Yeah, stretch, stretch whatever you gotta stretch. You got one last one, 20 seconds left. You can hit the hands, you can hit the shoulders, anything you got that you feel is maybe a little bit tight right now. Last 10 seconds, last one guys, 12 squats, seven push-ups. Last one. Okay, here we go. Five, four, three, two, boom. Let's get it. Last one. Nice. Nice. Hit those seven push-ups. 12 squats, seven push-ups, yes. Okay, grab a quick little sip. This one's gonna be awesome. This is where you can use your weight if you wanna use it. Awesome job, the last 10 seconds. Stay strong and break. So, Pay close attention. Here's how this works. We're going to be going for about at least 10 minutes. I'd say close to 15. We're going to do our best to go just right at it. Okay. A good hard sweat. Four exercises. I kept it simple. Four exercises. You're doing 
10 reps of each one. Okay, just so you can remember them. You're doing 10 lunges on each leg. Okay, you can alternate it in here, or you can do 10 on the same one. Just make sure you're stepping forward. Okay, you have 10 lunges. Once you do 10 lunges, you have 10 squats. So just remember, it's two on your feet. Okay, lunges and squats. Then you're doing 10 mountain climbers and 10 push-ups. I prefer Superman push-ups. The Superman push-up essentially is when you lay down, I'm bringing my hands up and I bring them to my side and I explode up. So I'm dropping my body all the way down and I bring my hands up just like Superman, tuck them in, pop up, okay? 10 of each, 10 lunges, 10 squats, 10 mountain climbers, 10 Superman push-ups. Okay, if you, do, if you can't do Superman's, just do it on, do regular push-ups on your knees. Okay, you can use the weights for the lunges and the squats. Now, here's the tricky part, okay, and it's going to be on me. Your goal is to do as many rounds as you can in two minutes. When you hit the two-minute mark, every two-minute mark, okay, depending on what two-minute mark we're at, so if it's two minutes, you're doing two burpees. Once we hit the four-minute mark, you're doing four burpees. Six-minute mark, we're doing six burpees. Make sense? We're going all the way to ten. So I'll take care of the burpees part. I'll let you know when to do it. But right now, I need you to get as many rounds as you can. Lunges, squats, mountain climbers, push-ups. Okay? Two minutes, as hard as you can. Here we go. Three, two, one, hit it. Start it off. Ten lunges, each leg. Ten squats, ten mountain climbers, ten Superman push-ups. You have two minutes. Nice. Solid, good. Nice, 30 seconds in, hit your 10 squats, good. After the lunges comes the squats. Then your 10 mountain climbers. So we're almost a minute in. Once you hit your 10 mountain climbers, you're doing your 10 push-ups. Nice. One minute in, guys. One minute in. Good. The goal should be to at least complete the circuit. Can you make it to the point where you can maybe do one and a half or two? It would be even crazy. That's cranking it up. 10 mountain climbers. 10 Superman push-ups, explode up at speed, good. And keep it going, back to lunges. Once you, hit, once you finish those push-ups, right back to lunges, yep. We're a minute and 30 in. So in 30 seconds, we're doing two burpees and then you restart the whole cycle again. Nice job. 20 seconds left until we hit the burpees, stay strong. Nice, here we go. Set yourself up. In five, four, three, two, one. Hit it, you're doing two burpees, round one. Two burpees, and then go right back into it. Go right back into your lunges. Three, two, one. Clock has started, boom. Wherever you just left off, right back at it again. Wherever you left off. So now once we hit this new two minute mark, we're gonna do four burpees. Okay, at the four minute mark. Stay strong. Nice. If you wanna work a little bit of biceps while you do the lunges, you can come in here. When you lunge, pull them in. Lunge, pull them in, pull them in. If you wanna do a little bit of biceps, just there. 30 seconds in, stay strong. Nice. You can do it also while you squat, yep. Or while you squat, if you want to hit shoulders while you squat, do a thrust. Keep them at your shoulders, drop into the squat, and when you come up, bring it over your head. So drop in, over your head, full extension. Bring them out all the way, yep. One minute in, guys. One minute in. Stay strong. Nice. On the mountain climbers, if you want to hit a little bit of back, 
while you're doing it, maybe you can row, row, and go right back into it. Row, row every four or three. Nice. Up to you. Nice. Lisa, that's awesome. Love it. 30 seconds left. We're going to hit the four burpees. Stay with me. Nice, cure. Explode up. Solid. Nice. Chris is using the band. Love that. 20 seconds left. Here we go. In five, four, three, two, four burpees. Do it up. That's round two. Four burpees. Four burpees. Yeah. Stay moving. Stay moving. Once you hit the four burpees, right back into your cycle. Here we go. Three, two, one. Set number three. Right into it, guys. Wherever you left off. Let's get it. Nice. Here, see if you can get full rotation. So in here, rotate them in and then right back down again. They face each other. Yeah, there you go. Drop with your pinkies, pop them up. Good. Love it. Now, Lisa, if those are maybe a little bit heavier or maybe you wanna work your arms, see if you can hold them. So right in here, yeah. If it's too heavy, it's fine. Yeah, you, you can curl them or you can hold them. If they're too heavy, just hold them here and go into your lunges. Up to you. Phyllis, that's perfect. One minute left, six burpees. Stay strong. Nice, guys. Yeah. Nice, Chris. Yeah, it's solid. That's really great. So we got 30 seconds left, six burpees at 30 seconds. Nice. Explode up. Yeah. 15. Kenny, how are you feeling, brother? Yeah. Here we go, guys. Five, four, three, two, one. Six burpees on you. Six burpees. Stay strong. Come on. Almost done. That's round three. Almost there. Six burpees. Yeah. Almost. Almost at the finish line. Last two rounds. On to minute number eight. Let's get it. Back to it. Back to it. Crushing it. Here we go. Three, two, one. Continue the cycle. Next two minutes. Let's go. Almost done. We got four more minutes of work. So options. Lunge it. Curl it. If you want to do extra on it, bring them up. Right? So I like to hammer curl it. In. Pop. If you want to do a little bit of both. Curl. Press. You have that option. Right? For the squats, you can keep them in. Drop in. Press them up. Into a thrust if you want to add more to it on the mountain climbers, okay? You can row, row, and hit two mountain climbers. Row, row, two mountain climbers. Up to you. Nice. Nice job. One minute in. Nice, Chris. Yeah, there we go. So Chris is doing one renegade row on each side and then one mountain climber on each side. Perfect. You can do additional in there too. Yep. Nice, Kier. Kier's doing a thrust. Love it. 45 seconds left. Nice, Lisa. 
Perfect. Last 30, guys. Last 30, and we go to eight burpees. Almost there. Yeah. Last 10. Good. In five, four, three, two, one. Hit it. Eight burpees. Eight burpees. Do it up. Eight burpees. Pop it up. Once you complete those eight, last round. Let's crush it. Yes. Almost there. Phyllis, how are we feeling? <laughs> I love it. Guys, last round. Two minutes, 10 burpees. Here we go. Crush it. Three, two, one. Game on, baby. Let's get it. Last round, last round, right back to it. Right back to it. Last two minutes of work. All different sorts of modifications if you wanna make it a little bit easier, a little bit tougher. Really good stuff. One minute in, guys. One minute. One minute mark. Yeah, I love that. That's great with the knee drive. Love that. There you go. Love that, Chris. That's awesome, too. Single arm. Yeah, Phyllis, now you're getting creative. Last 45 seconds and we go into 10 burpees. Stay with it. Nice, 30 seconds left. Woo! Last 15, guys. Last 15. Let's get it. Way to work. Five seconds. Four. Three. Finish off strong. Two. One. Ten minutes. Let's get it. Ten burpees. On you guys, 10 burpees, finish strong. Last one, 10 burpees. Once you're done with your 10 burpees, now you can grab your sip of water. We move on. Solid. And burpees, grab a quick little sip, catch a breather. I'm gonna give you guys about at least a minute or two. Nice and easy. Yeah, that was about 15 minutes, 12 minutes, a little bit over. That was awesome. So we're gonna go into a little bit of abs now, okay? Um, while you guys take this break. Here's Kirsten. For the abs, it's 10 exercises. 
Okay, I'll guide you through them. Each one is going to be 30 seconds. Okay, all 10 are going to be completely different. All right, so it's going to challenge us to keep on going. We're going to try to get one whole round in, so five minutes straight, nonstop. Super easy. Um, I'll let you know when you can use one of the weights if you want to use it at some point. I would probably recommend nothing more than a 10 pounder if you're going to use weights for these dots. All right. So, exercise number one, just so you guys can prep. Alternating single arm, single leg jackknife. So, right arm is on my favorite. Right arm is here, I'm fully extended. I'm coming across my body to touch my left foot. Right back down. Rotation, touch. So, I'm fully rotating to touch each foot. All right, make sure they're both coming up. Exercise number one, 30 seconds. I'll show you exercise two, three, three, all the way through. Okay, 10 of them. Here we go. Set it up. In three, two, one. Game on. Let's get it. 30 seconds. Alternate sides. Yep. Got 15 seconds left. Stay strong. Get as many as you can. Right now is about getting as many reps as you can get. Nice, guys. Good. Three, two, one. Exercise two. Straight leg setup. So my legs are going to be straight. You can use a weight here, right? I can hold it on my chest. And I want you to sit up all the way over your head. Or just bring your hands to your shoulders. Ugh, do your best to sit up. Three, two, one. Hit it. 30 seconds. Solid. Job. Last 10 seconds. Yeah. Three, two, one. Exercise number three, crunches. Okay, bring your feet up to the air. I like to put my hands by my ears. That way I'm not pulling on my neck. So I'm in here. I'm focusing on just my abs doing the work of tucking in. Crunches, three. Two, one. Hit it, guys. 30 seconds. Nice. Make sure you're not pulling on your neck. I like to put them by my ears. Can't pull those ears. Let's go. So right now we're focusing on the upper. It's like a slight little tuck. Just a baby crunch. You're the upper working. Nice job. Isolate just the upper. We did a little bit of obliques and rotation on the first two, on the first one, right? Um, now we're focusing on upper. Now we're going to focus on lower. Three, two, one. Good. Leg raises. Okay. Stay strong. Do your best not to put your hands under your butt. Stay to your side. Control the movement down until you feel no pain. And then right back up again. If it hurts too low, too low. Just bring them higher. Okay, but we're focusing now on lower. Feel that stretch in those abs. Pop back up again. Three, two, one. Hit it. Leg raises. So now we're going lower. Nice. Feel that stretch. Feel that stretch in those lower abs. And then use them to tuck those legs right back in again. Keep them stretched out as long as you can. Yep. Last 10, guys. Stay strong. Last 10. Good. In five, four, three, two. Yes. Toe touches. Now keep your feet in the air. So I'm in that position. Keep your feet up in the air. Slight crunch again. Come up, touch. Come up, touch. Okay, guys. Three, two, one. Short movement. Same thing. Right back to it. Short little movement. Get as many reps as you can. Come up, crunch, crunch. 
The goal is to get both shoulder blades off the ground. Punch it out. Fifteen seconds left. Yeah, nice, yeah. Looks like it burns. Three, two, awesome. Heel touches. So think of it almost like you're doing a glute bridge. So I'm here now, okay? You have two options. You can slide both hands and touch both heels, or you can alternate if you want to do a little more obliques. So up to you on which one you want to do. We're going heel touches. You can do in here as a crunch, or side to side, just make sure both shoulders are off the ground. Three, two, one. 30 seconds. Up to you. You're gonna go side to side, make sure both shoulders are off the ground and you're reaching as you do this. So you would just lay here. You gotta reach up. Touch those heels, touch those ankles. You gotta keep both shoulders off the ground. Or you can come up into that crunch. Less than 10, guys. Three, two, yeah, break. Right side plank. Keep that elbow under that shoulder. Come here, pop that head, pop. Bring the hand up. Here we go, 30 seconds. Right side first, right side. Three, two, one, and go. Right side plank, right side plank. Now, if you want to make this a little bit more challenging, you can grab that weight and have it overhead. You can hold it. If it's a little bit lighter, let's say it's a five pounder, you can maybe tuck it under and do rotations. If not, if you don't have the weight, you can still use your hand, maybe do a little bit of rotations in there. 15 seconds left. You can bring the leg up, the leg that's up, you can hold. Awesome. I'm gonna switch sides in five, four, three, two, Good, left side, left side plank. Here we go, three, two, one. Pop them up and hold. Pop it up and hold. Nice. Fifteen seconds, we're gonna go into up down. And we got five, four, three, two, up, down. You're going to go into that plank. You're going into that plank. And essentially what happens is you're going to pop up as if you're doing a push-up, right back down to your elbows. For this round, I want you to do only right arm. So it should be always the right. Right, left, right, left, right, left, right, left. Okay, so you're always going up and down with your right one. Next round, we're going to do left. Okay, three, two, one, hit it. Almost done with the 10 exercises. We got this one and one more. Let's get it. Up downs. Nice job. Last eight seconds. We got the last exercise. Three, two, one, last one, guys. You're holding that push-up position just about midway, okay? So as I drop in, okay, I'm here just about halfway. Hold that position, 30 seconds. Last one for core and for upper body strength. Three, two, one, hit it. Let's go. Five minutes of straight core. Game on, hold it. Do your best to hold it. Yep. 10 seconds in. That's 20. Good. Stay strong. You feel those triceps burn a little bit. Good. Those shoulders. Last 15. Stay strong. Nice cure. Yeah, Ken. Last 10 seconds. Come on, come on, come on. Five, four, three, two. And break, yeah. Grab a quick little sip. We got set number two. Let's get it. Set number two, same thing. 10 exercises all back to back. Challenge yourself a little bit more now. Let's get a few more reps or let's start adding a little bit of weight in this round. 
Let's do it again. That was awesome. That was awesome. Quick 30 second, one minute break. Let's get right into it. Here we go. How we feeling? Man, you guys are kicking butt. Nice. Set it up. Single arm jackknife. If you want to use the weight, hold it in one hand, right? Bring that weight over to that leg. You're going to hold it in both. Make sure you're using both. You're alternating for both. Okay? Or you can do one side and I can give you a cue at 15 seconds and you switch. Up to you. You have one or two. All right? Single arm jackknife. 30 seconds. Here we go. Let's set it up. We start in three, two, one, and let's go. Nice, Ken. Awesome. So I'll let you know when it's been 15 seconds. Good. So if you're doing single side, now you switch. 15 seconds and switch over. Nice, Lisa. Love it. She's using both. Love it. Three seconds left. Straight leg sit-ups. Good. Keep those legs straight. Weight can be at your chest or hands at your shoulders. All the way up. Set it up. Let's go. 30 seconds. All the way. Yep. Or you can bring that weight right over your head as well if you want to do a little bit of shoulders. Go ahead, Kenny. You're good. Yep. Straight leg sit-ups. Keep those legs extended. Just sit up. Stand as tall as you can on that sit-up. Use those abs. Nice. 10 seconds left. We're going to go right into crunches. Keep your legs in the air. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, hold. Nice. Keep those legs up. You can hold the, you can hold that dumbbell right at your chest. Crunch it up. Slight crunches. Do it up. Keep those legs up. Three, two, one. Hit it. Nice. Yeah. Emphasize the upper part, the upper portion of those abs. That's what you want to emphasize. Fifteen seconds left. Stay strong, yeah. Five, four, three, two. Love it. Keep your legs in the air now. Yes, fellas. Crunch up. Toe touches. Come all the way. Small crunch to the top. Keep those legs up in the air. Here we go. Three, two, one. Pop it up. If you have that dumbbell, this is where you want to use that dumbbell and bring it up. Small, small slight crunch. Bring it up to those toes. Is where you can use it. Yes. If you want to work a little bit more shoulders or chest, you can bring it down to your chest and then bring it up. If you just want to emphasize the abs, keep the arms extended the whole time and crunch. Bring those shoulder blades off the ground. Yep. Yeah. I see that, Ken. Good work. 10 seconds left. Stay strong, guys. And leg raises in five, four, three, two. Leg raises. You're going to use that dumbbell. Just keep those arms extended. Emphasis on the legs. Lower portion of your abs now. Lower portion. Feel the stretch. Use your abs. Pop them right back up again. Solid. 15 seconds in. Almost done. Here we go, five, four, three, two. Awesome job. Heel touches, okay? Come over, touch, right? Or you can use both hands for that crunch. Up to you, three, two, one. Do it up. Make sure if you are moving side to side, like I said, that both shoulders are off the ground. So you're like, you're basically in a crunch and you're just leaning side to side, but you should be in a Contracting, you should be tight, flexing the whole time as you go. Good 
Less than 10, guys. Five, four, three, two. Right side plank now. Right side plank. And you have that dumbbell in the left hand. So we're on our right side. You hold the dumbbell in your left hand at the top. Hold it nice and high. Here we go. Three, two, one. Drop in. Pop it up and hold. Nice. You can hit rotations in here with that hand, or you can lift that leg, challenge yourself a little bit more. Sorry. Good. Last 10 seconds onto the left side. Stay strong. Five, four, three, two, and switch. Left side, the dumbbell should be in your right hand now. Here we go. Three, two, one. Pop it up. Left side. Nice. Yeah. So if you're going to do the rotations, just make sure you're, it's almost like you're leaning, like you're reaching over. So you're looking under that arm. Rotate your body. Yep. Rotate your body and then pull right through again. Or, correct. Less than 10 seconds, guys. Stay strong. Good. Keep those hips high. Five, four, three, two. Awesome. Up downs, but we're going left side now. So I want you to think before we did right, left, opposite side now. Opposite. Okay. Left, right, left, right, left, right. Almost done. Last two. Three, two, one. Hit it. Left, right now. Left, right, left, right. Stay on those toes as much as you can. Challenge yourself a little bit. Good. Left, right. Left, right. Yeah. Ten seconds left, and we're going to go into that isometric hold with your push-up. Hold it midway. Stay strong. Here we go in five, four, three, two. Can we hold that push-up? Last one. Hold that push-up. Halfway. Here we go. Three, two. One, drop in and hold. 30 seconds. Let's go. It's on. It's on. Nice. Challenge yourself. Good. Even if it's not that low, but challenge yourself to slightly bend those arms. Feel it in your chest, your shoulders, your triceps. Stay strong. Your biceps. 15 seconds left. Hold it. Hold it. Hold it. Squeeze your abs. Hold. Nice job, guys. Last 10 seconds. Nine. Eight. Stay strong. Five. Come on. Four, three, two, and break. Yeah, let's go. 844, man. Love it. Woo! Grab a quick little sip. Let's just hit a quick stretch. Quick little five minute stretch. How are we feeling? That was awesome. Yeah, that was great. So, nice little stretch. Grab, your, grab a little bit of water. No, I'm just this. You guys can see me. Let's start off in here. Butterfly. So feet together. Feet together. Grab those elbows. And you drive those knees to the ground. You feel that right in our groin. So in turn. And drive. Let's just hold. Do it together. Nice and easy. Last time. Five, four, three, two, one. Legs together. Reach forward. Try to touch those toes. Hold it. Five, four, three, two, one. Wide. Right side. I like to go on the inside of the leg. That's what I like to do sometimes. Then we hold. Five, four, three, two, one. So side to the left. Hit it. Left side. Five, four, three, Two. You go on your back. And figure four. So I'm on this side. I'm gonna keep this leg in here. My shin, right, or my ankle gonna be on that knee now. Right? And you have two options. You can either tuck the leg in at the top or you can go under the bottom one and pull. Either or. Let's see. Get that figure four. Five. Four. Three. Two, switch sides, 
right over, same thing. And pull here. Drive. Five, four, three, two, one. Awesome. On one knee, so split stance. On the side. So both legs are at 90. Okay, both legs are at 90. Okay, from here, my goal is not to lean in and get that stretch. My goal is to actually tuck the pelvis, right? So if it's coming from the hips, I'm driving that hip forward. You should feel stretched right in those hip flexors and right in those quads. I'm not leaning. I'm standing nice and tall, but I'm driving that hip forward. Hold five, four, three, two, one. Point the toe up, same leg, and reach. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch sides, guys. Same thing, stand tall, tuck it in, and drive. Drive that hip on that left, hold. Five, four, three, two, point that toe up, and reach. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, nice. Stretch again, so starting leg. Here's what I want. Reach straight up. So I'm here, interlock those fingers. Reach. Straight up. Reach, 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 reach. Five, four, three, two. Now I'm gonna lean towards the front knee, to the front leg, so I'm in here. Opening up those lats and opening up that hip going in here. Reach on a diagonal. So not here, up here. Hold five, four, three, two. Now bring the hands in behind, interlock, okay? Pull the arms and that chest back. Feel that stretch in your shoulders and in your chest. Hold. Right in here. Same leg. Five, four, three, two, one. Switch legs. Last one. Almost there. Last one. Okay. Reach straight up. Pull, pull, pull. Five, four, three, two. Lean towards that front leg. Feel that stretch on the opposite side, around right that hip. Lean, five, four, three, two, awesome. Interlock, last one, open things up, drive. Five, four, three, two, and break, shake it out. Awesome job, ladies and gents. Thank you, Sunday service, woo! How's it going? Good work.